So I want to show you this uh, use of the Pieca glide scope to a trip in La Troncal, Ecuador. We suctioned out the little baby. It's a little three month old. And uh, got her all ready to go. Got a couple of assistants. One's a great plastic surgeon working with me, the other's my daughter. She's got the Cobalt glide scope ready to go here. And uh, I'm going to set up for a view. And there's the little uh, blade going in. And if you watch the screen, you can see easily generate a good view. Epiglottis goes way out of the way. And I've got my little pediatric stylet, which is the LTA with a 4.0 or probably 3.5. There it is, 3.5 minute tracheal tube, which you just saw go right in the larynx. It's just so easy to use this machine. The uh, epiglottis just goes right out of the way for you. It's really a beautiful piece of equipment. And uh, that 3.5 tube just goes right in place. Uh, and uh, you hardly even need to do anything else here. We're going to check the breast sounds and all. But basically, uh, this machine just performed perfectly on two month old, three month old, four month old. These kids were a little small compared to kids in the U.S. They're mostly under five kilos at three months, uh, but they behaved well. Now, uh, as we get towards the end here, I'm going to stretch this out a little bit and uh, just hook them up. But I'm going to. I've included at the end just a little uh, one minute um, show on how I made this stylet. I really like using that LTA because it's just the right softness. Uh, you don't do any damage when you stick it through the cores and it's easy to get there and it makes a great guide. And you can build that little curve in on it. It's just perfect for 3.5 and 4.0 tubes. And you could probably even cut a 4.5 down short enough. So here you go, here's my kitchen. Okay, I'm just going to show you how I made this uh, stylet for the pediatric glide scope. Take a normal LTA, don't worry about hooking it up. What we want to do is make it have that curve. That's the curve that really works well for the pediatric glide scope. So all you got to do is carefully heat it a little bit. It doesn't take much over a stove without burning your fingers. In a couple of steps, so we get that curve in there. Nice smooth curve, and if you do it slow enough, you can actually preserve the channels for your. Um, I'm going to shut the heat off. You can actually preserve the channels for the uh, local to go through. Now, if you're actually going to use it, you always got to make sure you lubricate it a little bit. And if you watch this, this is a 40 tube. I've shortened a little 40 ray tube, and you shoot it right through. Very thin, and see, you got that little tip the LTA, which is really nice to intubate with, with the glide scope. And then once you intubate, slide the tube in. So that's a nice, easy way to make a nice stylet for the glide scope for pediatrics.